Look at that. Look at that bricky. Okay, so I'm familiar place, but I haven't been back here in a long time. Uh, a bit concerned about the two bulls and cows here. Looks like they're moving on. Kind of a jerky walk here for a bit. But once I get to the water, we'll get going. See you in a bit. All right, so it's a little bit after sunrise. And um, the water here was 59 degrees. So I like that a lot. And I think I'm safely past any bulls or cows. At least let's hope so. And um, I'm treating this week kind of like my summer vacation, folks. I'm back to a new job on Monday. So we're going to give it everything we got in between. I think uh, right now I'm going to start with a gold. I'm going to start with one of those um, rebuilt gold Canadian Panther Martins, I think. To me that seems to make some sense. angle from walking around um, there is a lot of good fishing just below this but uh, not when there's giant cows in the way ah, here's actually a gold that I'll use it's a gold teardrop 15 it's a little bit on the heavy side here we've got a gold light 15 with a yellow red and white tail this one should stay out of weeds pretty good. There was a fish, all right. Decent brown to start. Looks like he's 13 or 12. Nice fat brown. He does in fact go 13. Well, he goes 14. Nice brown to start. All right, here we go. As I mentioned, that's a good sign. Two small brown. Okay, this is moving in the right direction though. Just a small brown trout, little guy. Yeah, there's something in the water there. Looks like a beaver to me. Looks like a beaver. That guy was hitting the whole way down. Is it a chub? Chub or little bricky? What is it? It's a teeny bricky. He's got one of the gill deformities. It's 
pretty cool color trash can green on the top not quite pinked up yet or anything pretty little bricky slightly better bricky and he's off, off and fish. slightly better bricky right there Shadow is counterproductive right at the moment. There's a fish. Oh, he got off. Darn it. Lost cool hit fish. though. He came out and then struck. Pretty cool. Nice cast. Oh, there's a On the drop. Nice brown here. Ooh. Could be a sneaky. All right. Not a big fish, but a nice fish. I think that's 16, 16 or 15. Yeah, pretty nice brown. He does go 16. All right. I'm trying to grab him a little better. Yeah, nice brown at 16. Pretty fish. It is a small bricky. And what? Yeah, small little bricky. Nice looking fish. So we'll go tailless lights over for a little bit. And the tailless seem to work better. This is a nice brookie. Little guy, but still nice. And the tailless does seem to provide a little bit more positive hit. Yeah, a little more body to that one anyhow, but he's still only about eight and a half, nine. Pretty male bricky. It's a little male. Drop bricky. My hand is still sopping wet, folks, so relax. Another small little bricky. Good to see all these fish in here. small bricky it looks like or is this a brown that's a brown just a little brown well interesting yesterday was a day of smalls tomorrow maybe a day of smalls too but 
we're here right now, folks. There's no way of knowing what can happen here just yet. There's still hours and hours. Another small fish. Another small bricky. Oh, he's off. Lost fish. When will the giant browns awaken? Little brown, a little bricky. That's a female. There's a better fish. I don't know if it's a bricky or a brown. It's a brown. Better brown. Ugh. Boy, he has anchored himself in. There we go, he's out. Yeah, another fat 13 inch brown, easy. That's a another bite of there. All kinds of nippers in there. This guy gets snagged. A little bricky like that. Oh, no, it's not a snag. It's just hooked weird on the side. Little brook. Lighting the whole damn way. More the same. Little brook trout. Where are the big ones at? Come on, folks. Right on the drop. On the drop. Another brookie right on the drop. Look at him go. Yeah, that guy's got some colors on him. Pretty, pretty brookie. Female. Brown. Pretty looking brown. Another small bricky. Wet 
sake. Another small bricky. Okay. That's about what's going on here today. That's a long walk if that's all I catch here today, folks, let me tell you. Okay. Oh no, a little brown. Not for sure that that would be a bricky. Just a little baby brown, about seven or closer to ten that guy was. There's a nice, oh, he got off, shit. That was a nice brown. Not a 20 or anything, but still. Oh, and he bit again, he bit again. It's gonna be a nice 17 inch brown though. Damn it. Shit. I hope he's on video. I, I was turning my head so you might not see much of him, but I saw him out of the corner of my eye. Nice fat one. Tree fish. Small brown. And he's off. Darn it. That stick was in the way to get him easily netted. A little brown. Pretty fish, though. We got here. Let's get another brown. A small brown. Go. 
is out. Oh, and there he goes. Sorry. No picture. Go back to that gold 15 light with the yellow, red, and white tri tail. See if that doesn't entice anybody a little bit more. There's a nice brown family. Whoa! <laughs> he saw the net and he took off and got off. Like a nice 15 inch brown. But okay. I like the gold action. Hey, I got him unsticked. We'll put him in a net since I've lost a couple of them trying to get out of the net. Alright, fish finally. And realistically, folks, I was not, you know, I'm saying last time I was here there was a lot of timber action, but generally there's not a lot of action right in this section. Um, so better fishing is yet to come there's always a little spot here where generally we'd always consider this a walk through kind of area oh stop it you this is a strong little fish right here He was fighting me the whole way there trying to get that hook out. Looks like he's 13. And he is 13 and a half. Nice brown. Most of the time it's always been, yeah, don't expect. Oh, there's a nice fish. He's going for the timber too. So we had a couple of guys here. It's an even nicer one. That might be the best brown I've had so far. He was not coming off. He might be lunch. I don't think it's too bad. It's not that bad. Yeah, there's a nice brown. I think I had one that was 16 that was earlier. He might be just a little bit better. No, that fish is 15 and three quarters. Nice brown. And that's about how it goes. You might hit, you might hit the timber and you might get a, a very rare day where every single piece of timber has a active fish on it. But more often it's like today where I think I've had those are two timber hits now out of probably 15 tries. Another nice brown. All right, well, maybe it's going to start now. I told you there'd be a point in time where. Things would go bonkers, and I hope this is it. There's a nice brown again. Oh, that guy's so pretty. 
back in it looks like another 16 inch brown so pretty get my hands wet yeah there's a gorgeous fat brown he might be 17 gorgeous fat brown he is 16 whoop and there he goes there he is so that's as good as that first one I had so not a best one size down to the gold number nine oval body let's see if that does anything because there that last one was a nice fish several nice fish in there let's see if the smaller lure gets a bite not the one that just bit. Shit. That was a big brown before that. It was an, oh, he's off. That one's over. That one was over 20. Lost fish. Two fish on two casts. See if this one can stay on. It's a little brown. Well, I would have loved to get my hands on those last few fish for you. They're nicer than that guy. But that's a pretty brown trout too. switch to silver they keep looking at it and going away another nice brown there um, they just might not be in the biting mood this is that silver diamond that I was using yesterday there's a fish finally Jesus it's been a while Oh, that's a really cool polka dotted one. He was never coming off. Hands wet. <laughs> Look at the distribution of spots on that guy. Just kind of all over random. An 11 inch brown. It's the first fish in a while, folks. I've had just a lot of comers and nothing. Pretty little brown trout, about 11, 9, 10, between 9 and 11, 10, we'll see.
Oh, here comes the beaver. Haven't seen him come out yet, but he came swooping down there. There's a, <laughs> that guy. They're just biting so light, folks. This is pissing me off. All right, I've got a few more spots that I want to check here, but otherwise I'm going to make make direct access here to the trail soon. Really disappointing that these fish are not in the biting mood today, but that's the way fishing goes, folks. So, you know, I still caught quite a few fish. I saw well over a hundred fish here. Lost one big one, maybe a second. I don't know how big that one was. But definitely lost one big one, but all kinds of small brookies and small browns. Uh, some nice 16, 15 inch browns. Um, and all in all, not terrible outing. It's just that I have literally seen more than a hundred fish come and approach my lure, uh, tap at it, and not, not strike fully. And I have changed size, color, method, uh, technique and to no avail uh, that's just the way it is today and uh, you know you don't catch a damn thing if you don't get off the couch so as always thanks for watching Wisconsin trout fishing and happy fishing thanks for watching and happy fishing